Dear students, welcome back to Full Scholarships Live Video Series. We'll be discussing about the uh, <clears throat> process for KAIST undergraduate scholarships in South Korea. We'll show you the full process for this. Before that, uh, let me remind you to subscribe to my YouTube channel Full Scholarships and do follow us on Instagram page as well. The link for this South Korea KIST scholarship is given in the video description below. You can check out any of the videos. Links are in the respective descriptions. Also in the uh, Instagram bio, you can see and in Instagram story or you can message us on Instagram and <clears throat> also you can check out highlights here. Scholarships are also published here with links and in Instagram or YouTube about section, you can see <clears throat> all the links are given there. And you can directly visit our website fullscholarships.net or catchmelook.com. Once you visit our website, you can read about this particular scholarship. And uh, here you can see the host country is South Korea. University is KAIST. Benefits is a fully funded degree level is undergraduate. Deadline is 6th of January 2026 for the uh, submission of application. So it's Korean Advanced Institute of Science and Technology and you can apply for this bachelor's scholarship it's fully funded and you'll be having full tuition fee monthly expenses and national health health insurance after that we're eligible so you must not hold the korean citizenship neither the dual citizenship and you must be an international student then the fields of study uh, college of natural sciences college of uh, life science and bioengineering College of Engineering, College of Liberal Arts and Convergence Science, College of uh, Business. So you can see these subjects are with the broad research and uh, study areas are there. Then the proficiency requirements. If you have eyelids to hold, well and good, but it's not mandatory. If you have completed your previous language, previous uh, degree in the English language, that's enough. Then required documents, complete application form, one recommendation letter, high school transcripts and copy of passport and financial resources how do you apply simply scroll down at the end you can see apply here button so there's also an uh, application fee of 80 us dollars involved in this so you have to pay that so click on this link to start application once you click on that you can see official website here and here you can see before you apply and or in application you can see apply online to the two six early so you have to click on this link to start application now once you click on that you can see application track is open here fall track 2026 20, so you have to scroll down and now you have to click on go to apply and then you have to click on ok so after that you can see you have to agree to terms and conditions agree agree click on i agree all and click on application now start the first you have to enter the last name here and then the first name after that upload a photograph and then you can create a password here so let me try to log in first if there is a previous account So we have some previous application here <clears throat> so let me modify the application this is a previous application so we can click on apply create here you can see click on go to apply same process so I had just to check that I had previously also applied to this. I agree. Click on continue. <clears throat> now enter your first name. Your last name. Upload a photograph. Uh, you can create a password here. You can create a password new then uh, enter the country of your nationality place of birth gender then date of birth so be sure to cross check with the passport now <clears throat> postal address email address this is mandatory
so you have to select the gmail or any other email you have <clears throat> then confirm email address then phone number telephone number then mobile phone number then guardian's relationship <clears throat> name of the guardian post address of the guardian then country code of the guardian then fields of interest you can see all the fields are there let's go with the mathematical sciences click on save and continue click on ok so we have to upload a photograph let me upload a photograph so i have uploaded it here now click on continue ok saved successfully now next step so you have to find the high school name select the continent select the country enter the school name you can see there are multiple schools you can search you can add the school click on ok it can be different school this is a just a demo application expected graduation if you are already graduated you can submit that and then recommended name so you have to same as high school you have to mention that position and email address of that and then telephone number and then the academics uh, list the names and other necessary information of a school that you have attended so just one we have attended so we will just submit that one and has your schooling been interrupted during so you can mention yes and no accordingly then the proficiency tests exemption so we'll click on this extracurricular activity and work experiences we don't have we'll click on save and so we'll uh, mention the one of the high schools entrance education you can see country so mention one by one city and then period now let's click on save and continue elementary middle and high school is also mandatory so you have to enter before that elementary we'll mention the same country here city then uh, other middle and then country city so interrupted so no <coughs> and uh, then we'll click on save and continue at least one extra curricular activity so we'll mention one sports or any other details that you have you can mention click on save and continue click on ok click on ok now next page test scores if you have you can submit them act sat any of the tests you have you can submit them but we'll just click on the uh, international bachelor we have we'll upload the diploma so one diploma you have to attach then the year of your completion so international bachelor should be there or if you have your sciences mathematics in your plus two after high school or you can say higher secondary education you have to mention that here so you have to mention which so we'll go with mathematics higher secondary level and score then uh after that any other exams you have you can submit them click on save and continue click on ok that admission type not available not available and not available click 
Click on save and continue GC. Okay, then the Cambridge test that you have. So we'll mention not available here. Click on save and continue. Maximum score required is seven. We'll mention seven. Click on save and continue. Click on OK. OK. Now step four awards and if you have you can submit them else you can click on save and continue click on ok now next step is a uh, statement of purpose mention sop describe the reason you should be selected describe the personal statement cite any cases or uh, made attempts from different sources then uh, cooperation conflict management other methods you have mention that family and social difficulties you have i certify i agree Claim and continue click on click on ok so next is a step six which scholarship resource you wish to apply so you have to mention kst scholarship and this is all then school violence information so no we do not have any click on save and continue click on ok this is the scholarship part you have to submit now you can see step seven eighty dollars of uh, application fee is there you have to pay that and uh, credit card domestic credit card abroad you can see you have to choose any of the suitable methods remit and states and you have to click on save or you have to pay through the credit card so once the fund approval is given you can see once your application fee is received there they will give you the application number only after that till then you can see Finance statement completes, SOP complete, field of interest, Gmail name, everything is there and application fee is being processed. Once it is processed, you can uh, preview or if it is if the application process, if the application pay payment fails, you can pay it now directly through a credit card. And in the meanwhile, you can check out all the information here. So you can go to my page and check out all the submissions you have till date. And uh, if there's anything pending, they'll be asking you to document submission after you can see is available only after application fee is paid so once application fee is paid you can submit doc submission and result announcement is also once application fee is paid it is available through the portal here so you have to check all the processes on the same application platform if you have confusions if you are not able to pay the application fee through the credit card you need guidance in that you can just ask our team drop the comment below down the video or directly to our website full scholarships.net or cashmilook.com everything will be guided there you don't need to worry at all and our team is here to assist you absolutely and uh, keep watching keep subscribing share the video with one who have just completed their high school or higher secondary examinations of class 12th or fsc and who wish to complete their ug or undergraduate or bachelor's program abroad so share them this video so that they can get this scholarship and apply in south korea this is one of the best opportunities to study and it's fully funded <coughs> ilh TOEFL is not required easiest scholarship to get for the asian students to study abroad so deadline is 6th of january 2026 keep that in mind and uh, submit this application within the time guidance is there on our website you can see free guidance but before uh, messaging or commenting below do remember to subscribe before sending us message on instagram and requesting for anything please do remember to follow so that our team can uh, subscribe uh, show answer you your questions because if you are not following us there it goes to spam similarly in this if you comment below the video it goes to spam section if you have not followed us or subscribed so just check out our website full scholarships.net or cashmilk.com all the links are in the video description as well as in the about section of the youtube so uh, just that's it for today hope you enjoyed the session keep watching keep subscribing keep liking this video keep sharing this video have a nice day ahead